What is the best thing that you've ever eaten? Like, if you were to ask me, what's the best burger I ever had? I could probably answer that or give you, like, a top three. Uh -huh. You know, there's Fred's in Atlanta, Georgia. There's this place in New Zealand that we just went to that was ridiculous, and I already forgot the name of that. <laughs> and uh, it was so good. We ordered two of them. And I have a really hard time thinking. <laughs> Oh, I yeah. get overwhelmed. <laughs> <laughs> what was the experience of finding out that you're going to be on Guy's Big Project like? Um, it was pretty surreal. I didn't expect in a bazillion years to be picked for that show. I just, I mean, I definitely tried in my video. I put myself into it and I edited it like I would edit anything else you know I was really nitpicky and sent in what I thought was a good product but I just you know you assume that there's so many other people that are like so much better than you sending <laughs> in stuff that you just you're like no I made my video like two days before it was due and I submitted it the day the last day because I was just kind of afraid and I I got a call like two hours after I uploaded it. Oh, wow. That's pretty that. awesome. <laughs> and, and when I did, um, when I got the phone call, I like I put them on mute and started running around my apartment. <laughs> <laughs> I started texting my mom. I'm like, you will not believe who is on the phone right now. <laughs> like, ah! Oh, wow. And I text my best friend. Text I'm like, oh, my God, I can't even with this. <laughs> so it was, it was crazy. Lightly, and like the whole process went so quickly. I was gone filming within like a couple weeks, and so I barely had time to process what was happening. I was just like, All right, I guess I'm doing this. <laughs> so, how did this experience change you in terms of like your perception of everything that you're doing? I learned that sometimes it's good to be uncomfortable, and that being uncomfortable allows you to be comfortable with more things, you know, like I didn't, I also didn't know that I liked being in front of the camera. I just, I wanted to be a host, but I forgot <laughs> the whole like, you need to be in front of the camera thing. And once you are, it's like this, this uh, electricity, this energy that you get knowing that you are being shown to X amount of people. You know, oh, yeah. I don't know, it was just exciting for me. <laughs> so when I got back from the show, I immediately started filming my vlogs. Like I didn't film any vlogs until I got back. That's been a tough road in itself, trying to figure out, because I'm my own producer, my own editor, oh, my yeah. own videographer, my own everything. <laughs> and so there's a lot that goes into it, as I'm sure you know. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's, it's, sometimes I'm like, what am I doing? <laughs> so, I, am, I am like that every day. <laughs> happening I don't know what I'm doing that means that you're trying to learn something new and then you'll get better at it and and that, that's what happened with my photography so that's what I'm hoping will happen with the video <laughs>